Welcome back to that and Tobago. We are live on CTV and Talk City 91.1 FM. Well, in observance of World Environment Day on June 5th, 2018, the Network of Non-Governmental Organizations of Trinidad and Tobago for the Advancement of Women holds its annual Corpus Christi Plan Sale. And here to tell us all about that event, we have none other than Ms. Hazel Brown, no stranger to us here. Welcome. How are you? Thank you for having me. Well, I'm trying to survive. You're trying to survive. Well, well you're doing the right be thing. Good. We're focusing on plants and eating healthy yes, yes. and growing our own produce. Well, as you know, Corpus Christi is more than just a Christian festival mm -hmm. event. It is a traditional planting season. Yes. It begin, marks the beginning, the full moon and the, and, and the rain mm -hmm. that comes with it. Um, as a network, it has been our mission to try to support households manage their nutritional as other needs as well as possible. And that is what the business is about, encouraging people to, to grow some of the food that they eat. You know, a lime in, in the supermarket costs $5. Yes, I do know that. So, so we help prov provide the mat planting material that people have. We, we have plants, food plants of, uh, of wide variety, seeds, as well as seedlings. And of course, herbs that a lot of people nowadays are, are very interested in, in growing their own basil and rosemary and mint that they can use to flavor our, our foods. So this is, a, this is actually a network fundraising event. We put plants on sale. But you know, the most exciting thing for me of, the, um, of this Corpus Christi plant sale, so which we've done for 10 years now, have been the children. Parents mm -hmm. come to the plant sale with okay. the children and ask the children what do they want to grow, what do they want mm -hmm. to eat. And, and, and we've seen children got very excited and involved. And maybe it's one of the ways to get them off the laptop outside to do something that gives them a certain level of satisfaction because we've also seen how children come back after they've planted mm -hmm. things to, to express the satisfaction that they felt to see this thing that they put into the ground and it grew and it produced things that they could eat yes it's exciting it's really exciting mm -hmm. for children so we encourage people when you come bring the children but are people do you think um, over the years have you noticed people moving away from planting simply because they're not paving their yards they can't deal with the grass some of it has to do with where do you get the material, where do you get, that is why the, the sale is important, to provide people with things that they wouldn't normally go down the street or go to the supermarket and get. I mean, so, so I'm just going to go quickly through the list of sure. what we have. We have Chatine, Chenet, Kaimit, Five Fingers, Pomerac, a, a variety of Pomerac that is small, not the huge tree. The Sweet Tamarind that you talked about. Yeah. Um, Pomegranate, a lot of people have shown a lot of interest in pomegranate over the years. The Jamaican plums, guava, mangoes, avocado. And for the seeds, we have pepper, corn, sorrel, bodhi, okra, pigeon peas, melon, gen. Seedlings, we have pimento, tomatoes, um, cabbage, sive, pak choy. Herbs, rosemary, basil, mint, fennel. We will take orders for citrus. We find the citrus is a problem. Um, and, and it costs me more to get the, the citrus to Port of Spain than the actual cost of the citrus itself. So we need people to say what they want so we're sure that we have what people want. So you can put in your orders for citrus. And the avocados are very few. But if we have orders for avocado, we will get them. What type of the avocados? Because I know there's a yummy buttery sort yeah. of avocado. But yeah. how long does it take to, to bear? Most things are taking between 18 months. For, for the sh there are some things, for example, like the palm city, that'll, that'll fruit in six months, the, the dwarf palm city. Yeah. But some things will take a year, two years, three years, depending. Most of these plants that we have are propagated by the Ministry of Agriculture. So they are, most of them grafted right so they're not it. they're not yeah. they're not growing from seeds so you have a grafted julie mango tree yes, there we, we have all ju for for the mangoes we have buckton spice cutlass starch zabico julie calabash you have julie and Great. Dudus, yeah. nice yeah. wonderful so we have a variety of <laughs> climate yes i love the, the purple climate <laughs> yes. yes i just so have planted one last year and how long would it take before you can get climate I don't, I don't know. I would imagine I would give the climate two years. That's not bad at all. Right. I planted yeah. one last year, and it looks quite healthy now. So You bought me and, a coconut tree. Everybody, we have coconuts. We have cassava cuttings. Mm -hmm.
We hope to get some sweet potato um, slips. Everything that you could want to plant in your back backyard. And we also will show you how in, even in small spaces you can grow some tomatoes, pimento, sive especially. Mm -hmm. um, some of the citrus is, um, is grafted, but, we have, but it really depends on what people want. The most popular citrus that we get orders for are limes and lemons. Okay. I have a, a wonderful um, lime tree. It's the mm. Portugal lime. Mm -hmm. It's really juicy mm -hmm. and wonderful. Mm -hmm. However, there's an avocado tree that it's forever. It's been years, and it has not this started to bear. bear. Why? What, I have, what do I, I have do? one of those in my yard as well. Oh. I have to, I'm going to find somebody to tell me why, whether you should just cut it down, yeah. because it looks quite healthy, yeah. but it produces Same absolutely here. nothing. I don't, those two that I have, they, I didn't plant them. But so I'm, I'm trying to say that maybe the ones that we will sell you will grow <laughs> and bear fruit. Um, because these two, actually, is two of them, and I didn't plant them. They, they, they just grew from somebody must, must have put a seed there or something. Mm -hmm. But that is a problem that we have with avocados that you don't have with a lot of other, the other fruit trees. Yeah. I don't know why. Let's Maybe somebody in the ministry will tell us yeah, why. Yeah, we'd like to know. Yeah. <laughs> Anyone why is my avocado looking? tree yeah, not Yeah, why is bearing? it not bearing? Yes. Moringa. What are your thoughts on moringa? It's becoming quite it's popular. It's become quite popular. Mm -hmm. Actually, it says it is, it is us tongue people who don't know about moringa because all the people in the, in the country know about, about moringa. moringa. It's always yeah. been there. <laughs> but I suppose it's become popular now because there's evidence of, of, of its usefulness for a lot of things. In fact, one of the features we have in our plants plant sales since last is a lady who calls herself Madam Moringa will be there. <laughs> Madam Moringa. And she will bring not only Moringa plants, but she a lot of products that she makes <laughs> out of, of, of um Moringa? Of from Moringa, yes. Like so what? What products can you make out of Moringa? Cosmetic things, soups, tea. Really? Packaged in well, tea I know bags. tea, but I didn't know you can make cosmetics. Yeah, she a whole lot of, of, of if you come you will see a lot of stuff, stuff that she has been making and selling. Not only selling, but pa very in very attractive packaging. Yeah. Drinks, Moringa <laughs> drinks she, she sells. And she takes orders for these Moringa products as well. So that is a special feature of our plant sale, the Moringa demonstrations. You know, with society now and globalization and everything, everybody's so busy. People are trying to balance two jobs. What is your advice to people who think that it's not really worth it to invest time it's a planting. It, 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 well, for two things, there's a therapeutic value to the planting, right? Yeah. And, and, and people can ex will explain to you the, the effect you have when you put something in the ground and you put a little water in it, and two weeks after, it's, it, it's growing. Yeah. And one of the things about the Moringa itself is that it grows very quickly, and it grows from pieces. Like yeah. a, a, you can break a piece and just stick it. Up, stick it in. Same thing yeah. with my mint. I have a mint plant, which, which very, very so often I have to tell you, I cut it down because it's growing too fast. It's growing more mint than I can, <laughs> I can use. There is that value, emotional and psychological value that you get from producing, and like I said, especially for children. So children know that milk doesn't come out of a box, mm -hmm. and juice doesn't come out of a box. It comes out of a plant that people grow, and that can be used in, in a variety of ways. These are things that we have to ensure that our children know. We have to know that our children know Pomerac. True. And that they know about Chenet. Yeah. At least they've climbed a tree. Yes. <laughs> right. <laughs> Leave the, the laptop. And <laughs> and make sure the tree doesn't fall on you, but <laughs> make sure that you... Um, so we have... We will have all of these things and say, like I said, like I said, bring the children. Where is this taking place? We, our, our network office is in the professional center. It is on Fitz Blackman Drive South, that is opposite to the Jean Pierre Complex entrance, on the corner of when you turn from Rison Road to Fitz Blackman Drive, behind Lyons, opposite St. John's Ambulance, that general area of Woodbrook, we will see the professional center. And that's where our, our network office is. And we have a, a huge grass area in which we've put up the tents and the plants uh, are there. And, and it's just fun to just come and you know see what is available and See what you might want to try. I mean, if you never had a climate tree, I, I, I very tree. strongly recommend climates. <laughs> and you said you have the purple. The purple climate. Yeah. yeah There's yes. also the kind of green ones. Green one, yeah. Yeah. They're mm. both very yummy. Five fingers. Mm -hmm. Carambula, people call them. Passion fruit. 
which doesn't take a lot of space, which will go on your fence. Yeah. It's a lot of stuff. Great. Are you particularly pleased with the response that you've been getting over the years? Well, the, yes, yes. In fact, I, 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 we sent our invitation to um, Mr. Kamuna. He was one of our, you know, he's a registered farmer. Oh, okay. No, and he's know. always been one of our best customers. So we <laughs> hope he will show up um, this year as well. We have customers who've come over the years, so they come and get what, they know they'll get what they want, and they'll get good quality mate planting material. I also got some planting soil for people who think I have it, but where, what am I going to plant it in? So you do some have that there, yes, planting that. soil, pots yeah. and that sort of thing? We don't have, no, we don't have pots. So you, you just plant soil okay. in, the, in the bags, and you put it in your own pots. Great. We didn't think that there, there was a market for pots. Okay. Because like I say, we have to sell the stuff. We are there until Sunday. Mm -hmm. But you know, we have the two holidays, Wednesday and Thursday. Yes. So we're going to do Friday, Saturday, and Sunday since we've set up. On Saturday as well, because, you know, this was a World Environment Day event, we usually do our solar cooking demonstration as part of the plant sale. So on Saturday morning, we will do a solar cooking demonstration. We will actually set up the, 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 the things and cook on Saturday morning while we talk about how the solar cooking thing works. We have two solar cookers two different varieties, an American one and a South African one. But we will also talk about, I'll tell you how to make one for yourself or where you can get one, where you can buy one. Okay. But well. people won't buy a solar cooker except they've seen how, that, it, that it actually works. works. So the food that we cook on yeah. Saturday, we will eat <laughs> on Saturday at lunchtime. Okay, wonderful. Thank you so much, Ms. Brown. It's been mm. a pleasure chatting with you. Very, yeah, very I enjoyable. Hope you plant your I will coconut. plant my coconut tree, mm. I promise. And, and, and I look forward even, to the climate and, tree as well. And the climate as well. Great. Yes. Thank you so much. Well, that's our show for today. Uh, news is up next. Have a wonderful holiday.